I first encountered this puzzle or problem somewhere in the 70s watching a uh, popular detective series. In this particular episode, he was investigating a murder that occurred at a Mensa clubhouse. Of course, these people that have high intelligence, over 130 IQ. And it turned out that the killer actually posed this uh, puzzle or problem to the detective to check his uh, IQ. Probably more so to distract him from his investigation. Anyway, here's the problem. There are three sacks, and you could have actually four or five. The strategy is going to be the same, but there are three sacks of gold nuggets. However, one of the sacks contains fake gold or phony gold, as the uh, detective put it. The real, the real gold nuggets weigh one pound each, and the fake gold nuggets weigh 1.1 pounds each. You have a scale that is accurate to the nearest tenth of a pound. You can weigh as many nuggets from the three sacks as you want, but you can only weigh once. So you can take you can take multiple nuggets from each of the bags, but you have to weigh them all together. And like I said, you only have one one weigh. And based on the weight, you can determine which bag or sack contains the fake gold. So how would you determine which sack contains the fake gold? Pause the video and see if you can work it out. Okay, so here we go. Here's what we have. We have, say, sack number one. And let's say you take one nugget from sack number one. Let's say you take two nuggets from sack number two. And three nuggets from sack number three. And then you put them on this very accurate, and again, it has to be an accurate scale for this to work. If you were to have all three bags, all three sacks with real gold, each one would weigh a pound, so this would be six pounds. The weight of these six would be exactly six pounds. But if you put them on the scale and you got 6.1 pounds, because you took only one nugget from the first bag, that means that that bag contains a nugget that weighs 1.1 pounds, which would tell you that sack number one has the fake gold. Now, if it turned out that you weighed these and you got 6.2 pounds, since you took two nuggets from sack number two, you got 0.2 pounds left over, that would suggest that this bag contains nuggets that weigh 1.1 each, which would tell you that sack number two contains the, the fake gold. And of course, in the same manner, if you got 6.3 pounds when you weighed all, all, all the nuggets together in the scale, that would suggest that the nuggets in sack number three weigh one pound point one since you got 6.3 pounds. And that's how you would determine which sack contains the fake gold. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.